Hey all, Koenig here, back with another RPG horror story. In this video, we have a player who is going through some personal issues in real life, and unfortunately tries to take out his frustrations on the table. So, without further ado, let's roll for initiative and get into the story. It was about three years ago now. A friend wanted to run a Dark Heresy campaign with me and my friends. You have me, the guardswoman, Bill, the bounty hunter, and a tech priest. Only the first two are important, then the GM. Bill is playing his character in the it's what my character would do kind of sense and was melee. This happened during the beginning of the second session, so I never felt my character out. So she was kind of just a girl with a gun. So we are fighting the big bad boss of the prologue, a pirate lady. Tech priest is down. Bill is in melee and dying. Next up is me, then the boss. Now if I don't shoot, Bill will die. There was a chance I hit him, but it's slim. I overcharge my gun, fire a three round burst, and hit him. Okay, I have a reroll. I hit him again, but worse, with a crit. He loses a point of a stat, enough to bring his max hit points and damage down. We all laugh, including Bill, so we think he is okay. It is just a game after all, none of this matters. So the boss goes down with me gunning her down the next turn. I do a big enough crit to set her on fire. The next chapter we mysteriously wake up on a ship. My character is reading a steamy romance novel. Then he attacks my character. I thought it was just an out of character joke, you know? We do a little joke vignette, laugh, then we go on with it. I disengage, go back to bed, reading my steamy novel. He says, you disengaged so you can't dodge. I attack again. I'm going to kill you. At this point, we are all like, WTF, and ask why he is doing that, and he said, because you hurt me. GM steps in and says, no, we are not doing this, let's continue. And then he goes on a tirade about how he just came here to roll dice and have fun. Sometimes he does quite often, then gets mad when he loses or something doesn't go his way. He then launches into me about how I always try to get away with stuff, and how the others let me get away with stuff too much, it's all BS. No, this was the first time we all played an RPG with him, and I think this is the first time he played one. He then leaves for a smoke and comes back and plays. We later find out he was going through a nasty breakup and was taking it out on us, which he always does and never apologizes. In post. Yeah, I think if you're going through a nasty breakup, the best thing to do so that you don't offend others is just take a week or two off of the game. Even if you really want to play it and take your mind off of it, you never know what's going to trigger you and cause some sort of an outburst like this, uh, especially if you know you're kind of prone to that. But yeah, so that's probably how the uh, the player should have handled that. Uh, anyhow, that was all for this post. Again, another short and sweet one. I'm hoping to start doing some longer ones in the uh, near future. Uh, if you like the post, feel free to give us a like and a subscribe. It definitely helps us out with growing the channel. And if you like the content, uh, just check back in about two to three days. There should be another video. Uh, I know that this one was a little bit later than I had expected, ran into some technical issues, uh, on top of the fact that the whole SpaceX and, and NASA, you know, ISS docking thing happened over the weekend, and I was pretty well engulfed into that, I kind of forgot to record a video, so on top of a technical issue, it was about a day late, and I apologize for that. Uh, but yeah, I'm shooting for about a two to three day release period for videos, so about every two to three days you should see a new video. Um, and I'm hoping to start having them be a little bit longer so that we're not just blazing through a story and ending up with a longer post story uh, section than, uh, than a story section. Anyhow, thanks for watching and keep on role playing.